Hello my beautiful peeps and welcome back to Liza P. Today we are going right back into the factory. We're gonna find Vanini. I'm hanging out with uh, my future friend here. Thank you so much for being here. Make sure to leave a like if you're enjoying the Liza P playthrough and without further ado, we're gonna level up some stuff. I wanna address a few comments that I've seen about this dude here. So I'm not like super familiar with Pinocchio. But a lot of you guys are telling me that Geppetto is actually a... A pedo? A pedo? A torpedo? <laughs> I just wanted to get you guys' thoughts on that. Is that true? I mean, his name is Geppetto. Now I can't see him the same way. I really can't. Apparently he made me so I could be like his... You know what? Let's just move on from the topic. What I wanted to do is I wanted to get this upgrade here. The Link Dodge. Because I feel like that's probably going to be the best one out of the four. I think I'm going to get lower damage while dodging. Increases an enemy stagger duration. This one could also be kind of good because I found myself kind of missing the uh, The opportunity like they kind of recover like pretty fast So my question is are we gonna lose all of these options when we move on to phase two? I guess we're about to find out but maybe they'll get carried over charges fable when a perfect guard is successful I, I kind of like that I'm gonna get that All right, so now We have phase two guys That's pretty sweet Increase pull cells, retain guard regain one, retain a certain amount of uh, when receiving damage. Okay. Rising dodge enables dodging when on the ground. Oh, that is so useful. Crazy how we just don't have this already. Like this should come with the game. <laughs> Add amulet slot. Okay, that's wow. This phase two actually has a lot of really good stuff. Okay, so now if I click on this. All right, so it's the same ones. Okay, well, well, obviously we have new ones. All right, cool. Hello, weirdo. Do you have anything to say? Okay, it's the same thing. Me. Shut your face. Don't touch me. It's time to level up some stuff. Um, I have a ton of ergo stuff. Um, so first, I would like to maybe upgrade my axe before we head out into the world. I know my way around a weapon. So let's do that. You can bring your Jenny cranks to alter weapon handles. Each handle's property upgrades based on your character's default abilities. You can change this property and grade one time with a handle alteration. However, you can always reset it with balance crank. Oh, oh, this could be interesting. Oh, whoa. Whoa, that's a cool move set. Okay, what if we do one of these and uh, booster? Wow, this one actually brings the stats up like quite a lot. I don't even think I checked this blade before. This one looks pretty interesting. What does this look like? <laughs> Holy shit. Ah, uh, that's kind of dope. Covers a lot of ground. Damn. Okay. I might try this out, guys. Let me just make another one before we head out. We'll do this one and and the fire axe handle. How would that even work? I gotta see this. <laughs> what the shit? Yeah, that actually looks kind of cool. This looks like something you would make if you were like stuck on an island. Yeah, this is kind of dope, guys. All right, we have three uh, new weapons that we can test out out in the world. Let's do, this one's already at a plus two, which is great. Um, let's level up the, the ax though. How much can we do here? Okay. Not enough materials. Okay, perfect. Mr. Benini is the richest man in Krat. His company manufactures most of Krat's exports. He's a uh, peculiar, but a good-hearted man. Even though he's rich, he treats every employee with respect. Good for him. I heard he went to shut the factory down. I hope he's safe. Okay, so let me acquire some more of these fragment thingies. I think we have, yeah, we have quite a few. Let's just consume all of them. Let's just take them all. We also got this one in the last episode. We didn't read it. Um, the watchman contorted and broke from the adult's desires. However, he never forgot the children who considered him their friend. Okay. More talk of children. But this one, this one I think is a little bit more wholesome <laughs> than Geppetto. How many points can we do? Three points? Uh, yeah, yeah sure. 
14. I'm cool with that. It's time to head out. I'm excited. I also realized that I did not use my arm like whatsoever uh, in the last episode, like the new like electrical shock arm thing that we got. So I want to I want to test that out. And uh, yeah, I'm going to start at the first little bonfire here, uh, Stargazer. And I'm going to take a left where we found the survivor because I noticed there was a big room there while I was editing that I didn't even check out. So let's go in there. Maybe that's where Vanini will be. That will be sick. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there, man. Right now we have this weird ass prison weapon, which which I'm cool with, like I said. Let's see, let's see how we do on damage. But also, oh, <laughs> nice, dude. Four. Wow, that actually does a lot of damage. Why are the numbers blue now? Oh, probably because I used the arm. Okay, so we gotta be like hella close for this shit to work. Oh. Voice. Oh, <laughs> not bad, eh? Not bad. Okay, can make sure to get this. Okay, okay. Why did I say anything? <laughs> See you, bitch. That is so satisfying. I already love this weapon, guys. Ouch. That was not very nice, pal. Voice. Okay, so. We're gonna go on top of the pipe and then cross here. Yeah, we already took care of the uh, the boss down there. You guys told me that apparently I missed a chest, but I got it. I, I got it while the poison was still on there. Um, I don't think there's like another one behind that. Or no. No, I think we're good. And uh, my, my two friends were up there. I believe this was the room that I didn't check last time. Yeah. Yeah, this looks... This looks... <sighs> Okay. There we go. Pull yourself together. You have a duty to this city and to your own sterling reputation. Oh shit! All right, this is the way to progress, guys. One hundred percent. And this is where they're freaking storing this poison shit, the acid. Warning: Beware when handling corrosive chemicals. Again, the messages go away way too fucking soon, man. Uh, be careful not to melt your fingers. Okay, I will try my best. There's a big piece of machinery down there. Oh, hello. How the fuck did you even see me? Some of you guys are telling me that um, for the perfect guard, it's like it's best to like hold it a little bit. Like like a lot of you guys have found that really helpful. So um, I know what I just did was just a guard. I was not going for a perfect guard, but I really want to test that out. Oh my God. Okay, you're coming for my head. And that's okay. Idiot. Whoa. A lot of health. What the fuck? Big ass shovel, dude. Oh, oh, oh. Fire. Whole stamina gone. Idiot. <laughs> Damn, dude. I really thought I was going to get that one. Come on, Pat. Hmm. Oh, shit. Overheating. Damn, dude. Alright. I got this. Oh. So annoying. Nice. Come on, give me the stagger. Fine. That's not even a stagger. What the fuck? What am I thinking? Okay. I gotta get more used to the the like the dashing, bro. Like I either treat this game like it's Sekiro or I treat it like it's Bloodborne. I gotta find a nice in between, and I just missed it. Maybe I should have gone the one that the skill that makes that stay longer. <laughs> I will get this. I will get this. I don't care if I have no heals left. Fuck. Oh my. Okay, I hate this thing. I absolutely. I'm dead. I'm literally dead. Yeah, I overheat it. <laughs> this is karma because I didn't kill the last guy we uh, we found that was like him. Um, I probably should have. I would have learned the moves a little bit better. 
We're trying this out. I want to see if it makes a little bit more damage. Okay, so. That's rather disloyal. Quite insulting. Huh. Different dialogue. Okay, you know what? Oh, wait. I should definitely get this first. Don't turn around, idiot. Good. Oh, what? Oh, I like that. I like that. Let me grab this shit up here first before we go into war. Oh. Wait, wait wow. Okay. Looks like they want us to go on that super sketchy path. I'm cool with that. I have to stop oh. Them. Oh. <laughs> Vanini. <laughs> We found him, dude. I'm literally, we're literally twins. How exciting is that? Uh, let's just talk to the boy. Hey, man. Do you know? <gasps> I'm wearing his glasses too, bro. Hold up. I want to be part of this gang. <laughs> oh, easy now. No need to kill me. Surely we can discuss this like reasonable people. Of course, Venini. Hold on. Geppetto's a friend of yours. Did he send you? This is ridiculous. I, I'm, uh, I'm fine. Please, help me find my butler, Pulcinella. Pulcinella. He's a puppet and a friend. Okay. Those stalkers were supposed to be working for me, but... Uh, well, they bolted and left me to my fate. That was not helpful. My butler went to barricade the back door, and I haven't seen him since. Pulcinella has been a loyal companion. I'd hate to lose him. Pulcinella. The factory is, of course, my priority. We must take it back. But please, keep an eye out for my... For my butler. Yeah, yeah, I got you, Benini. Consider it a personal favor and owe you in kind. Sounds good, buddy. We got... <laughs> we got the fear. For all this... Uh, Emote. This chaos... Fuoco was the puppet in charge of the furnace. Fuoco. But he changed. Oh, is that he the boss? He was a stand-up fellow once. Now, not so much. Yep. I'm Fuoco. told he's still building an army of puppets and marching them on the cathedral. Interesting. How did this nightmare come to be? Please, you must stop him before he does any more harm. I got you, man. God, you talk so slow. Before all this, uh, yeah. I'm told how did Fuoco, I will defeat him. All right, now let's sit. This is uh, this is clutch. We don't have to go through that big guy anymore. I'll see you in a sec, Benini, Fettuccini, Benini. <laughs> so maybe we leave that one be for a little bit. I can definitely go on this. I've done parkouring in the past. I did enter Londo. No problem. Oh shit, okay, yep. We got people throwing shit at us, of course. Okay, that I can't make. I mean, I probably could, but it's kind of dangerous. Can I go on here? Yep. Oh snap! Give me a second, pals! Oh my god, I almost fucking pushed myself over the edge. Ah! Fuck. Wait, we haven't even tried that double, double dodge. It literally feels no different. Oh, no, it does. That's cool. Sick. All right. Is there anything else on this floor? Nope. Okay. Maybe we can, like, drop onto that guy? No, I probably wouldn't do shit. Damn, ergo fragment. Uh, yeah, let's just go this way. I'd rather play it safe. They see me. You missed, idiot. I should really, uh, I should really kill that big guy just for just to feel better about myself. Um, the puppet cannot refuse the grand covenant uh, imprinted upon manufacturer. It must obey the creator's orders and cannot harm humans. But look at that puppet that was once called Fuoco. All right, the boss is near, guys. Is the grand covenant flawed? The once faithful puppet now kills humans. It creates puppets instead of fire. It obeys something else other than humans. It's as if someone is controlling it or it has a mind of its own. As if there's a king of puppets somewhere. 
Is it pretending to be human? Is it a simple defect? This requires further investigation. It's surprising. Foco's actions were not simple obedience, but faith. Foco worships something as God. I heard there's the King of Puppets on Rosa Isabella Street. That sounds like another boss. That must be what is controlling the puppets of Krat. But a puppet having a human ego is a problem from another dimension. There is still a puppet secret that I don't know about. Ergo is probably the key. But those guys are awakening like humans more quickly as days go by. Someone has to stop them before it's too late for the sake of all humans. Yep. That's why P is here. Indeed. Uh, let me cross the safe way. Yep, no problem. Easy does it. Yo, this weapon's sick, bro. I'm doing so much more damage than I was in the last episode. It was like four hits to kill these. That was two. That's good. That's very good. Alright, so... Hey, bud. I really want to kill this thing. And I think this weapon's going to help us out. So, let me just get rid of, like, the other ones. Whoa. Bro, I'm excited for this boss. Fuoco. What he made makes fire. Works in the furnace. That's exciting. Maybe I'll change my uh maybe the fire axe wouldn't do so well against him. That would make sense. That's clearly the way. Is that another stargazer? No, that's a that's an item, right? Oh my god, yeah, this this isn't a boss entrance. I don't know what it is. Oh no, that's a specter thing. Got it. Damn, so the rum bag, we have to go through these, like, columns here. Or not columns, uh, you guys know, you guys- What the fuck? Sorry. <laughs> A giant machine running at me from the side? Uh, yeah, that just- that just scared me. What the f- Pal, do you want to come down here? You're not being very smart right now. Oh my god, okay. Broken game. Oh, oh now you want to go down. Okay, no problem. That was good, P. Watch out for the overheat. Okay, that didn't do shit to him. Oh. I, I, like, get locked into whatever the fuck he, like, puts me in, you know? Oh, did I take the wrong item? No, I'm good. Don't put me in a fucking corner, pal. I'm in the corner. We. Damn. He always falls up after the uh, charge attacks that I try and put him through. Yeah, bitch. What's up? Come on. Give me the kill. Nice. Come on, Pete. Come on, Pete. Nice. Oh, beautiful finisher. You need a standard radiation converter. Could that be of use? So weight. Wow, it's very lightweight. Physical damage reduction rate does go up. Fire damage reduction rate goes up. Electric blitz damage, okay. Acid damage, fire resistance goes up as well. Okay, this is clearly for Fuoco. That's probably why they're giving it to us. It's going into Fuoco with, uh... Ugh, no, we should probably go sit back down and then go in. I want this first round to be, you know, a first, a, a fair shot. I do have a lot of ergo as well. Let's quickly go back to the hotel. Level up, like, one point, and then... Fuoco time. <laughs> Crazy fucking name. Kinda sounds like a rapper. Lil Fuoco. If that's not taken, I'm taking it. L Lil Fuoco. <laughs> Let's level up our technique. Oh, I don't have enough ergo. Classic. That should do it. Sick. And we're back, guys. All right. Let's go defeat this uh, this fiery boyo. Which is kind of funny because the last uh, in the last video, uh, last Armor Core episode, we literally fought uh, like a like a. I mean, he also had like lava or fire or whatever. So. This is just a fiery week for us here. You will not touch me, pal. Skedaddle. Thank you very much. All right. I am not going to use a specter, at least for the first few rounds, unless the shit is absolutely ridiculous. Uh, but let's just check it out, man. Is there anything back there? 
Load up. Nope. What is this? <laughs> Alright, I'm stalling. Let's do it. Authorize a homo... Uh, it said something. I, I gotta read it when we come back for the second round. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh! <laughs> I was gonna say, it's kind of cute. <laughs> cool. It's got a little trumpet. Alright. King's Flame Fuoco. Still can't read that. Join me? Okay. Music banks. What do you got to offer, sir? What the fuck? Nice. <laughs> you missed your first attack. Oh, damn. Ooh, shit. That's a lot of damage. That's gotta be a weapon, bro. His, uh, yep. Flamethrower, that makes sense. Okay, I think I just need to get out of the way and chase him for that one. Ah, oh, okay, no more charge attacks. Oh, my. This time is kind of whack. Gee. What did I just say about charge attacks? Okay, we are not doing good whatsoever. Okay. That's more doable. Got it. The fuck? Ugh. Okay, there's two. There's three. <laughs> Damn. That was a really short round. Very short round, indeed. Buddy's got a lot of health. I might try out some, some different weapons. Um, hello? Panini, how you doing? I will take care of this, no problem. Try not to fall into the acid. Okay, so music, bangs. Uh, boss design, pretty cool. Okay, so what does this actually say? Homo machina. Ho homo, ma homo machina? Homo, homo, um, yeah. All right, let's go in, baby. Round two. Here for a good time. A long time. Oh. Okay. Nice. A little bit better here, P. One, two. Okay, you're just going crazy now. What's the timing on this? I should just... Yeah, I think I might just get away from that. Because even if we get a perfect guard, is he just gonna, like, push us like crazy into the wall? Ooh, fuck. I gotta, like, really time my freaking moves here, man. Okay. What the fuck? That's so hard to telegraph. <laughs> no! Get up, Pete! Jesus. Okay, his range is like, oh, kind of short, but... What are my windows here? I need to find my windows. Brother, I'm literally clicking guard. Oh, here we go. That's fun. Thought we were gonna get a staggered... Bro, I swear I'm clicking it. I swear. Nice. No. Oh, okay. That worked. Okay. Okay. I think I need some range in this. Fun! Can we get the half? Fuck. What the fuck? Alright, his attacks are actually pretty hard to telegraph. Like, I, I am not seeing them coming, like, at all. I, I think I need to slow down and try not to attack as much and just, like, figure out his freaking pattern. This is gonna be fun. Another pretty great run back. Let's try... I want to try a different weapon. Uh, maybe something with a little bit more range. Let's try our, our prison, prison weapon here. Leave his ways. No. I, 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 I can't read that shit. Beautiful. Okay, I think we're doing a, a little bit more damage. 
I didn't really check the last time. Rookie mistake. Oh, there's another one coming. Yep. Got it. Trying to get your health back. Don't forget, brother, you are one of us. I think that's what it said. It's like they want you to just, like, really concentrate on reading and get killed. Oh, that's a crazy one. He sneaks the left arm in there. Nice, P. Let's go. Okay. Okay, no. Dodge to the side. That was close. That was close. Mm, not good. Join our mission. Join the gang. Is that what is that? The gangs? <laughs> I doubt it. That was not that was not good. Oh my god, that third one comes in so fast. Okay, will we see? I need to I need to just run away. I need to be further than that. Mm -hmm. God damn, Foco, you're kinda you kinda cool, dude. Oh. oh my god, he just fucking kicked me. Oh, I missed the freaking stagger. It's so annoying. <laughs> this guy's going nuts. Okay, give me a second face. I want to see it. Yeah, here it comes. A ring, my ring. Bigger or something. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's brutal, dude. I shouldn't even have used it. Okay, and now he's shooting shit at us. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna use these pillars. Are we safe? No! I should have known that. All right, with a little bit of practice and a little bit of luck, we're gonna get this, guys. No specter. <laughs> okay, this round is pretty dead, I would say. Ooh, nice. All right. <laughs> I like this weapon. I definitely like the range. Um, sorry, I'm looking at my hand. I cut myself earlier. That's <laughs> enough messing around. So we're dealing with fire in the second phase right off the bat. I couldn't really tell how far it spread. Uh, I hope it's not the entire fucking arena. That would suck. Let's go, baby. Oh, God, I need to... The window, bro. It's a very small window to get that perfect guard. Okay, that was just my mistake. <laughs> I think I might as well just go for, a, like, a guard. You know, just hold it. Better than getting hit completely. We can Bloodborne rally our way back. Uh, I thought I had more. Space. I like that. I gotta watch my stamina too. I always have my face so close to my monitor that I like completely neglect like the corners of my screen. <laughs> nice dude. Stagger him. I thought I was dodging away from that, and Buddy just went straight. Staggered. Bam! Good. Good P. Fuck yeah, look at all that damage. Alright, so now we just run away because the fire. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, we're good. 
I like that strategy, just running away. <laughs> this guy's kind of dumb, eh? Okay, no, run! Okay, so he's just throwing up. How far does that go? Okay, okay. We can we can stay stay away from it. That's good. That's good. What the fuck is that on the ground? Oh shit. Boil. Uh. Is there a pause when the fucking theme repeats? There's not like a seamless transition? That, that may have been my... That could have been my headphones cutting out. Uh, okay. Better. We're still dead, but... Don't get shot, P. Okay, okay, okay. So, okay, so the rest is gone when he starts shooting the second round of this. If I can get this pole cell, fuck, that would be incredible. Oh, more fire, more fire, more fire. Whoa, okay. We're good. This guy is really playing the, the long range game here. Nat. How effective is that? Okay. <laughs> that was that was bad. Here we go. Well, almost forgot to grab those. My 81 Echo. Oh, it's out. Fucking Ergo. Crazy that they named it Ergo. It's so close to Echo. Another massive freaking coincidence to Bloodborne. Nice, dude. Okay, so 376. This does make more damage. But that was two hits. Okay. What the fuck? I think my other weapon may have been better. I might switch. God, man, you made so much fucking damage. Alright, this round is not it. I died so fast. <sighs> okay, we're going back to the other one. I like our... our prison shank. <laughs> Let's try not to have such a, a horrendous round. Nice. Okay, get his timing. That's a good window when he does the hammer down. Aha! I got your third one, bitch! <coughs> what? What? So is this guy's face and his crotch? Is that is that the deal here? That's kind of goofy. I gotta master the the perfects. That's what I gotta do. Okay. <sighs> you gonna do the fire? No. You gonna run around for a little bit? Have some fun. There we go. Fuck. Do I have enough room here? Nope. Not a good timing. Pretty bad, actually. There we go. Ah! Cheap shot. Cheap fucking shot, Fuoco. Bitch. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> this is fun. Nah. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out, beep. Watch out, beep. Run. Oh my god, bro. This guy's slow as shit. Probably because I ran out of stamina. Now I'm going to die from overheating. That is so annoying. I'm off to get more items. Yeah, I might, might have to get some more uh, ailment potion thing things. Oh, that's brutal. That is brutal. It was actually a good round. It was. I'm dead. Yeah, gotta fucking hit the button as soon as it's about to touch my face. 
when it when it touches my my eyebrow hairs that's my eyelashes that's when i gotta click the button the window is so small i bet they put this here so some people like fall into the acid not gonna be me though i'm not falling in that acid time to die pal i've had enough of you actually no this is actually pretty fun i gotta go a couple more rounds but i don't want to so i want to defeat you Wait till it's about to hit you, P. Sometimes he just throws that left arm out of nowhere, bro. That's the move. Yep. What was that? Nice. Ooh, I was ready to perfect, perfect guard that. Duh. <laughs> I hate you, Foco. I hate you. Okay, I just gotta wait, man. Just gotta wait. Come on, perfect it. Perfect it. Are we, are we in second phase? No. Why is he talking? You missed a kick. Ugh. Horrible time. Horrible, 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 horrible. Fuck, man. This takes me back to Bloodworm. Trying to get that rally, you know? Okay, there we go. He's lighting up his crotch. Or his head. Nice. Alright, this is where things get a little spicy. Get away! I gotta stop trying to sprint and just like dash away. What the fuck is happening? Alright. Alright. Okay, running is a viable option when he's when he's shooting his stuff. Fuck. Fire, 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 fire. It builds up so fast, too, if you get caught in it. It's not good. Oh, buddy. Okay. Learning his moves. Learning... <laughs> Still surprises you from time to time. We almost got a new pulse cell. Just fucking clutch. Nice. Run, P! Sick. Sick. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to have all the stamina in the world. Are you done? Mm -hmm. Okay. Fire, fire, fire. This is good. This is definitely the best round so far. <sighs> Still not very close, though. Okay, when he does that, we're actually safe down here, which is kind of nice. 
Oh, I hate this fucking perfect guard window, bro. I, oh, it's, don't blame the game. It's your fault. I know I'm, I'm hitting it. I'm, I'm hitting the fucking button. Clearly, I'm just not doing it at the right time. Yeah, that's frustrating. Okay, I'm gonna practice more dashing than, than guarding, and I think that might help us out. Unless it's something like that. Ah. Okay, I'm done with the charge attacks. Unless it's this. <laughs> So much better, dude. Once you get that stagger, like... Can't miss the stagger. Okay, run away, P. Run away. God, I always start second phase with one heal. Gotta get freaking better at that. I missed both of those. Iconic. Oh my god, bro, his reach. Oh my, oh my god, bro, he had me locked into. Oh, <laughs> this is annoying. I'm not gonna try the Spectre. Even though it probably wouldn't even help that much. All right, let's start off on a, on a good note here. Take your time, P. Take your time. Get the first hit. It's usually a good sign. Somehow, I find it easier to time that third one that's like really fast than the first two. Get cocky or greedy, P. Just do your thing. Master of puppets. Oh man, if I was streaming on like Twitch, I'd be listening to Master of Puppets right now. <laughs> I'm kidding. The steam. The steam banks. This is a good theme. Not as good as the uh, parade master, but still pretty good. Raid Master is still my number one. Good shit, man. Oh, that was close. Let's go, B. If I can get that stagger, that'll put us past half. Don't get greedy. You got time. You got time. I'm too far. No. Fuck you! Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we're now we're at half. Now get past it, which is fine. What the fuck? Okay. It's a very good round. <laughs> Don't jinx yourself. Knock on wood. <laughs> All right. Focus, B. Focus. Get away from his shit. You don't need to be all up in his ass. Okay. This guy's got his ass in the front. Okay. Are you done? Oh, damn it. I panicked. I spammed it. Ah, oh, the fuck, man. I'm out of there. I'm out of there. Oh fuck. There's a wall. At least his uh, projectiles are kind of slow. I appreciate that. Woo! I should 
probably dodged towards him, so I'm like, I can get an attack after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is clearly one of those fights where you just gotta be patient. Go the long run. At least that's the way I'm gonna treat it. Taking my sweet time here. Who's in a rush? You in a rush? I'm not in a rush. Yeah, B. Fuck yeah. Stay in the pocket. Stay in the pocket. Ah. No, that was a lot of health. Get up. Fucking takes forever to get up. <sighs> oh fuck, why am I running towards him? We're gonna do this, guys. Why the f am I trying to dodge away from that? Oh shit. What? Oh, what? Dude, it's like instant. Oh, it's brutal. Brutal, brutal, brutal. There's some hope. Damn it. Okay, get your stamina back. Mother trucker. Shit! Wait, what? I got the fucking why what? What? No fucking way! I literally got the charged. I I I what the fuck, bro! I literally did the hold while the stagger was going on. Oh my, that is infuriating, bro. Ha! Oh, that's some bullshit. Did I not? That was literally a hold, wasn't it? Fuck! I'll have to. Oh, I'll have to check it when I edit. I bro, I did I da. If I didn't hold it, I was like a second, like I let go like a second too early. That is bullshit, man. That was such a good round, too. Well, <laughs> I mean, it was good. If I, uh, that is, that is a piss off. That is a piss off. Just, oh my God. I didn't even, oh, I forgot about these idiots. Terrible place to stop. That was so close. Uh, I'm just going to leave that whole round in so you guys feel my pain. That was some bullshit, bro. That was some bullshit. Yeah, I just picked my nose. Fuck. <laughs> I think I was maybe being a little too bit too passive. I think I get his moves a little bit better now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna be a little bit more aggressive while being very careful still. 
Phase one is like, is like, it's good, bro. It's just, bro, I got that stagger, man. I'm upset. I really am. Fuck. That's what should have happened. Oh, what? Fucking leg. Ah, uh, I'm too late. Nope, I'm good. <laughs> it looks like he's pissing. <laughs> what the f Bro, it happens immediately. Crazy. They just want to break your momentum. It does go away pretty fast, but by that time, like, your fucking half your health is gone. Double there. Ah! It's a tough cookie, man. It's a tough cookie. Ah, <laughs> oh, the kick. Stupid ass fucking kick, and then that shit. I'm trying to see how aggressive I can really be while still being safe and learning like the perfect cards. That's really what I'm trying to do right now. See, like, the first time he does it, he's, like, kind of slow at it, but some other times he just starts, like, right away, pissing, pissing fire. You can kind of see when he's about to shoot. He, like, lowers his, uh, his weapon a little bit. Damn it. Oh, my. Okay, I gotta run, like, either... Yeah, I can't run to the sides. Oh! Uh. Man, I already forgot what round we're on. Already forgot. Let me know how long it took you guys. I think I just need to manage my stamina a little bit better. Well, I gotta do a lot of things better, but that's one of them. <laughs> this guy is a bitch. Bitch. <laughs> Ah, I think we're almost at the hour mark. Eh, not really. 48 minutes. That's, that's, okay, we've done. Come on now. Planning about 48 minutes on a boss? Do you forget where you came from, pal? Come on now. I think it's more so the fact that I know I'm dying because I'm not really, like, improving. You know? I mean, I am improving, but lately, past few rounds, <laughs> not so good. I think I need to slow down. Slow it down. Wait for the windows. This game is like, just like Bloodborne though, it encourages you to be aggressive, you know? And when you want me to slow down and take my time, it's like, nah, bro. Fuck that. <laughs> Damn it. I gotta also get the perfect guards. Perfectly. That'll help out. This guy is hard to telegraph though. Hey, he really is. They did a good job on him. God. <sighs> Fuoco, 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 Fuoco. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright. Ah. This is it. Go in and out, in and out, in and out. Perfect. Perfect guards only. Nice. Good pee. <coughs> Hell yeah! Get up, coward. Oh. You got me. Oh shit, he's touching his wee wee. <laughs> We're trying a different weapon. <coughs> it's gonna be amazing. This is gonna be the one, I'm telling you. <laughs> telling myself. This one's a little bit slower. Gotta get used to it. Nice. Every time I'm feeling nice, I'm just gonna back it up. Fuck.
Oh, oh, I like the Fable Arch on this. <laughs> that was dope. That was dope. Greedy, what the fuck? Fuck, I need that upgrade that allows you to jump on the ground. Shit. That was close. That was close. <sighs> Alright. Ah. You dash, I dash. Oh, you bastard. I need to get more of these potions, man. Oh, man. Okay, we're still in the game. We're still in the game. <laughs> oh, Jesus. To help me. I kind of like this weapon, though. It's not as fast as the others, but we are dealing a little bit more damage. I really need to get more of these potions, man. Just in case, you know? I hate that fucking overheating shit. Like, we could have such a good round, and if at the end we overheat, like... Uh, ooh. Let's just give it another shot. This might be the one. I'm just gonna keep saying it until it's the one. The sword has like a big wind-up, which is not ideal. Ah, fucking clicked it, man. I need to get a camera on my controller so you guys can see this shit. Fuck. I hate you. That one was too early. I'll admit that. And that was just bad. Guess with the foot.
Ooh. Ah. Okay. I'll take it. Okay. Oh. Well, shit. Well, shit. Well, shit. Oh, you mother. You mother. Hello, mother. You suck. Not, not my real mother. Whatever. Shut up. This is why we need to get more potions. Yeah. We need some more of those ailment cures things. I'm fine. Ugh. I'm fine. I'll be fine. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I say? What did I say at the beginning? That's the one, baby. You just gotta, you just gotta believe it, man. You just gotta believe it. <laughs> wow. All right. You know what? We had quite a lot of perfect guards, which is, oh, that looks nice. Which is uh, crucial in this game. Crucial. I was dashing a lot more. I was, you know, doing my thing, man. Fuck. How many rounds did that take? Am I talking too much shit? <laughs> did it take too long? Let me know how long it took you guys. I I'd really appreciate it. But let's move forward, man. This is, uh, that, that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun to, to, to understand and to get better at. Um, switching to that weapon also uh, definitely helped a lot. We have 6,500. Uh, we have 6,500 ago. Uh, I just want to see what's past this. Maybe this will, like back to this I'm going the wrong way yep what do we have here a broken butler puppet oh that's Benini's well, puppet seem to remember someone on the second floor think it belongs to him no way we gotta ask what happened sometime now's good oh damn you poor thing I think I should probably go see Benini before we move forward guys yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's build some, uh, let's build some antici anticipation here. Uh, let's just go to this one. Whew. That was a lot of fun, though. That boss was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed the, uh, the theme slapped. It was cool looking. Uh, it was really hard to telegraph in the beginning, but eventually you, uh, you get good, as the cool kids say. Oh, look at him just clapping at me. He knows. He knows what I just did. Ah, you're back. Yes. And you found... Oh, dear. Pulcinella. They really did a number on you. Pulcinella was proof that puppets possess true courage. I will not rest until I have revived him. Oh, yeah, I guess but you can bring him back. There will be ample Prepare time them. for that. First, I must thank you for a truly heroic piece of work. The factory is ours again. The puppets are going to be in really bad shape after this. Let us return to the hotel and rest while we can. Nice. Our first friend in the hotel, guys. Like from the outside world, where we obviously have a lot of friends there. I but... cannot shake the thought of that puppet army. What they meant to do. The cathedral is filled with refugees. People who thought they were safe. Is that the next location? But that's for the future to solve. Maintenance must come first. See you at Hotel Krat. Yeah, a real dirty. Goodbye, Vanini. All right, guys. Uh, let's go see what was ahead, and uh, we'll go to Hotel Krat, man. Actually, I want to check in on the lady in the window that we talked to. She mentioned a cop. Uh, I forgot to check back on her in the last episode. So let's go do that after this, before the hotel. But I want to see what's ahead. Perhaps the next location. Or... Right back to... 
maybe this will tie back to the place we were already at, kind of. Probably not, because the boss was blocking it, right? Oh, snap. Why is there a light on this? Oh, shit. Okay, that was stupid. That was, f <laughs> that was fucking dumb. <laughs> Fire canister. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this is just gonna lead to the outside. That was actually where I wanted to go next. Oh, wait, no, this looks totally different. Oh, hello there, friend. Nice to not be fighting a giant machine anymore. Giant puppet. I gotta stop calling them machines. I mean, they kind of are machines. You know what I'm saying? Wait. Yo, are we going into, like, some kind of village or something? This is giving me, like, Resident Evil 4 vibes. It's kind of cool. I should probably go back to the hotel. <laughs> With this much Ergo. I'm too curious. I just want to see what's ahead. Oh, oh God. Okay, no, I should probably, I should probably go back. <laughs> I don't know why I jumped in. <laughs> Alright, so let's not roll into those barrels. Barrels with the lights are bad. Oh my god, this is literally Resident Evil 4. The fucking pitchforks. Is this gonna, like, lead to, like, the outside of Krat? Kinda getting that feeling, dude. That would be dope. Or just some giant, like, underground level. Yep. <laughs> All right. Makes sense. Uh, can I get a stargazer? It feels, feels like this would be a good place for it, no? Oh, God. Damn, they hear you from, like, far away, dude. Don't hit the barrel. Barrels are bad. This is dope. Okay, find the next stargazer and then go to the hotel. That's the move. Like it would maybe be down there? No, probably up here, eh? I'll drop in a bit. This is so risky. You guys have been like telling me like how like good this game gets, like because I've been praising it so far, and you guys are telling me, like, nah, dude, just wait. And that that's really, really exciting. <sighs> What's this? Big pipe. Nice. Big pipe. <laughs> that better not be poison down there. That would fucking suck. Okay, can you get up? Thank you. I gotta say, it's really satisfying to smack these freaking puppets around. Absolutely love it. Yeah, especially with this uh, big bonky sword. Alright, so we already went upstairs, came down here. I missed an item up there. Of course I did. That wall's gonna break for sure. Yep. Pretty hidden. Special purification amp ampule. Ampule? Ampule. We're gonna call them ampules. Uh, so that's. Oh! Fuck! It's another one of those, dude! Ah, oh, those are so annoying. Dark. Oh, sweet. Dark moonstone. Oh, man. Okay, I should probably go back to the hotel. Or, like, just run for my life. You know what? I believe in myself. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. No, I can't. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Just from up above. You know what? I don't think I've thrown a single item in this game. And this seems like the perfect... Oh, he's gonna go away, though. Classic. <laughs> can we sneak up on him? Go slow pee. Slow pee pee. Yeah, slow pee. 
Oh my god, I should probably... Yeah. Alright. We got this shit. We got this shit, guys. It's gonna be totally... It's gonna be fine. Oh, we're going into the outside world. Fuck. Alright, what's the best plan of attack here? I'm gonna pop one of these. Take your sweet time, V. There is literally no rush. Oh, man. There goes that overheating shit again. Just breathe. In and out. Nice. Fuck, man. He's got so much health. <laughs> We're gonna be here a minute. What the fuck am I locked onto? I left an enemy over there? Oh, it's the stricken barrels. That's what it is. Ow. Damn it. Maybe we can, I can get him to, like, walk into the barrels? Oi! Oh. That's, did that work? Oh, are you serious? Okay, you know what? You know what? Emergency, emergency plan. It's taking way too long. I can't use this many stuff. Oh, there it is. Yes! Worth it, dude! Oh, Moonlight Town. <gasps> Classic. Oh my god. <laughs> you know what? I respect it. Trying to make a Souls-like? Yeah, that's very Souls-like. That's fine with me. It's fine with me. Just gotta get good. Oh no. Oh, no, dude. I mean, I could just run away. Let's be real here. You know what? It wouldn't be so hard to get this money back if I died. I, it really wouldn't be, but... I just... I really want to get this guy in one go. We clearly have to. Okay. Can you fucking stagger already? Jeez, Louise. Oh no. Oh, you bastard. Miss my chance. Oh no. Oh, no. This is not looking pretty, guys. This is not looking pretty. This is when the heart starts to beat. Real fast. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God! Alright. Well. <laughs> Time to get this money back. Fuck, I should have just gone to the hotel, man. Fuck my thinking. How many souls likes later and I'm, I'm still making the same mistakes? Same shit. That's gonna be a hard watch. Definitely lost a few people on that one. But if you're still here, I love you. Thank you for sitting with me through the pain and suffering. <sighs> I hate when that happens, bro. It's gotta be the worst feeling on the planet. We are gonna have to defeat that guy, though, because obviously we can't get to the freaking stargazer without it. I mean, while I'm here, should I just kill him? <laughs> no. Let's go to Hotel Crad and then we'll let's do this, guys. I'm coming for that freaking stargazer. So let's try the fire. 247. Let's try this one. 475. <laughs> we like that. Oh, yes. I don't care if we use all of them. <laughs> Idiot. Okay. You know what? Fucking use everything on this guy. I don't give a damn. 
This is my revenge. This is literally torture. Pure suffering for the boy. Oh, okay. Now I really can't fucking die, though. Oh, it's not bad. Greedy. So greedy. What the fuck? What the f- Yo, 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 yo! What is happening? What the fuck was that? Did they do that? That was kind of bullshit. That was big bullshit. Holy crap. Oh, I hate these fucking things, dude. Oh my. Oh my god, dude, I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna die, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> this is what happens when you get cocky. This is what happens. What if I just run in here? Will he stop following me? Oh. I don't know, man. Whoa, did puppets do this? <laughs> I'm stressing badly. Okay, I just need to not suck. Okay. All right, I fucking retire. I retire. <laughs> oh my god, this is so bad, dude. I don't know what's happening, guys. We're gonna go do something else. We're gonna go do something else. I am, I am, oh wait, I need to get my, I need to get my stuff. <laughs> Nobody panic, okay? Nobody panic. The stress, the stress really got me. Please go easy on me in the comments, okay? Please. I've had a long day, okay? It happens to the best of us. Maybe I need a different weapon. No, I, I, I can't believe I just blamed the weapon. I need to just get better. Those enemies were tough, though. Can you can you guys agree? Can you guys fucking agree with me? Everyone's gonna be like, "Oh, I killed them at one go." It's, fuck off. <laughs> They're tough, man. Especially that one. That one's different. That one is different. Come on, idiot. I am in no position to be calling enemies idiots at this point. You know how many throw balls I fucking lost? You know what? I didn't lose them because it was a learning experience. See, like, you get to this point and it's like, ah, oh, fuck, man. Like, I should just, like... I mean, you know what? I'd be playing better if I didn't have that many, like, um, uh, things to lose, you know? It's because I have these things that I'm, like, stressing. Although, it's very easy to get them back. So, I don't know why the fuck I'm stressing so much. I mean, in a way, we're farming. We're, we're farming we're, we're farming these uh, these ergos. I just really want to explore that town, man. But maybe we just leave that for the next episode. It feels like it's going to be, obviously, well, it's obviously going to be the next new area. So, all right, let's go to the Hotel Stargazer. Stargazer. <laughs> oh, that was so painful, guys. I'm so sorry that I put you through that. Uh, what was that, like? 20 minutes of just i mean we discovered a new area killed a bunch of enemies got like almost 10,000 000 ergo gotta look at the bright side gotta look at the bright side <sighs> coping at least we get to listen to this beautiful music now ah uh, my queen my queen my queen my I queen my power to help you oh oh that's that's vanini's dude you already fixed him hell yeah he's a fast one uh where should we level up here Probably vitality. <laughs> oh no, stamina. Uh, st I mean, uh. let's do two stamina. Let's do some. Let's get some technique in here. Okay. I am able to wield ergo. They call me a listener. A listener. Because I can hear ergo. I inherited the power from my mother, oh. who hated it, called it the devil's power. So I kept it a secret that I could talk to puppets. Cool. Now you are the only one my voice reaches. So Sad. I beg you, please save Krat. I got this. I got this, ah, my queen. If it isn't my sister. Oh shit. Glad to see you made it back in one piece, my friend. Oh, he's got a cool office. What's going on, dude? Buongiorno, and welcome to the house of Vanini. I am Master Vanini's Major Domo. Major Domo. At your service, sir. Hell yeah, man. The house of Vanini carries only the finest in luxury merchandise. I believe you'll find all items to be both superior quality and distinguished provenance. 
Just like your hair. I am certain you will be able to find something that suits you, sir. At the house of Vanini, even priceless things have a price. <laughs> Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance. Cool. Cranks, 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 cranks. Liner, liner. Wow. Okay. That is good stuff right there. Increases handles, motivity, technique, advance. That's awesome. Mr. Vanini. There you are, my boy. My savior, yes, that's the word. <laughs> you took back the factory and I cannot thank you enough. All right, you can stop clapping now. Without the factory, no more new puppets. The army has run out of recruits. My friend, you saved, well, all of us. Ah, but listen to me going on and on about my concerns and... I don't believe I've even introduced myself. Signor Lorenzini Venigni. Gentlemen, bon vivant, and at the moment, utterly at your service, my friend. If the name Venigni rings no bells, perhaps you've heard of Kratz, Prince of High Society. That is because they are one and the same. Just two of the many names I've collected in my three decades here on Earth. Three decades here. Okay. While I sincerely believe meeting Venigni is its own reward, I have not rewarded you in the more uh, traditional manner. Please, Ooh. take this. Low gift. My newest prototype. It'll be safe with you. It's a grinder stone that keeps granting special attributes to the grinder. I hope you'll put it to good use. Appreciate you, man. Hell yeah. Grinder modification tool. You can equip a special grindstone on a grinder through Venini or a Stargazer. There are different types of special grindstones that grant different effects to your weapons. You can use a special grindstone effect in battle only once, but it recharges if you revive or visit a Stargazer. Sick. Uh, then my eyes do not deceive me. I never imagined I'd actually see it again. And in the flesh, so to speak. I just designed it, set it aside, and never got back to it. Genius and the claim can keep one quite preoccupied, I'm afraid. You are really interested in the arm, I see. Then, my friend, you shall have it. It just needs a few mechanical adjustments to fit your um, particular needs. And frankly, this design is almost child's play to me now, so let's start by making it a bit stronger, shall we? I will also add what we brilliant inventors call modularity. That means it will be much easier to improve and repair since you'll be able to use commonly found parts. You might say this arm's new abilities are... Uh, legion! <laughs> no? Too much? <laughs> it was too much. Nice. I always welcome friends. All right, uh, switch grindstone of grinder. Flame grindstone. Temporarily imbues weapon with fire. Well, we got to try that shit. Cool. Oh, my God. I just know this guy's going to talk forever, man. All right, let's see how fast this guy can talk. Of course you're curious. Pulcinella has been restored thanks to you in a small way. Mostly it was me, but, uh, you know, genius never rests. Except for beauty rest. <laughs> <laughs> that was not that funny. Pulcinella <laughs> isn't just my butler. He's my family. The only one I have left, really. I won't forget what you've done for us. If you ever need anything or find yourself in a spot of trouble, call on your friend Venigni. Venigni, Panini. All right, swagger. Hell, Jay. I always welcome... Fr All right, just one... Last thing. No one, not even I, know what started the puppet frenzy. Why? That day of all days. Ah, it was horrible. A violent rampage of murder and mayhem that is seared into my memory for all time. Yeah, that'll give you trauma. And it was never supposed to happen again. I made sure of it. Designed a few special parts to ensure they'd remain loyal. Puppet armies do not arise by chance. 
There was intent behind this. I don't want to leap to conclusions, but the only one I know with that kind of power is the King of Puppets himself. The King of I, Puppets. We need to learn how this happened. Is the King of Puppets going to be like the final boss? I mean, he's the king, right? That's it. That's all you got for now. Cool beans. Love this freaking office. Switch Legion Arm, craft Legion Arm. Oh my god, bro. This game just keeps like throwing new stuff at you. It's kind of wild. The Flamberg, a Legion Arm full of burning flames. When its muzzle is open, it burns the enemies before you. Huh. Required items, Flamberg. Oh, what is this? I don't think I have this yet. Falcon Eyes. Is that just like. That's cool. That's really cool. Grenade launcher. Oh shit. A legion arm that can block enemy attacks with your left arm. When it receives a blow, the embedded device explodes and deals damage to the enemy. That's dope. What does this one do? Putting something on the ground. Oh, it's like a proximity thing. A legion arm that can install a motion sensing landmine. When the landmine is buried in the ground, it explodes upon. Oh, these are pretty dope. So this is another one we can add to this one. Oh, we already have this? Yeah, we already have this. This is the next one. Movable charges. Oh, so you pick which one you like and then you upgrade it through different things. Or you can just do all of them. <laughs> I'm sure they'll give us enough material. Oh, this pulls you in. Press and hold the Legion Arm button to track an enemy. I think I'm going to save this Legion Caliber thing for when we get some of these uh, cool ones. Oh, what is this? The factory. Lorenzini Venini. No doubt my reputation precedes me. I come to you with only the most peaceful intentions, and as a true friend of Kraft. Behold, Venini works, where we will honor the city of Kraft's history while forging her brilliant future. When I broke ground on this place, this guy is cool. We broke ground. I like Venini. I certainly didn't do it all personally. This was a simply empty space, a blank canvas. But in the hands of a maestro, it became a work of art. All my life, from boyhood to this There's very a lot of dialogue day, in this game, though. <laughs> I have been derided for my... I do rather this than, than reading a bunch, though. ...focus on a lifelong obsession with building animated automatic autonomous automata. But today, just look before you. Venini Works is ready to start building the future. Kratz's golden era is waiting to be built. A dream of the future we can only create together. Help me make this future come true. Join us, for this moment in history will happen only once. Join Venini, your friend for life. <laughs> This guy is a true marketer. I am sold. Amatsa, that is one slick prototype. You think it's a tram for crickets? Is that the tram that I walked, woke up into? I'm trying to look inside. <laughs> what is on this board here? Got a creepy face, a brain. We should also go talk to some of the other peeps. Uh, hopefully they won't talk as long as Vinny did. Oh, dude, I feel like he loves his own voice too much. Oh, we should probably read the King's... Yeah, to Fuoco, the ordinary puppet protecting the factory's fire was a sacred duty. As soon as he learned of the King of Puppets, he bowed down to a new god. I want to meet this King of Puppets, bro. I know my way around a weapon. Uh, let's upgrade some stuff here. Let's do this one. I do like it. I do like it. I just... I fucked up too much with it. <laughs> Makes me upset. Uh, we have not tried the big pipe wrench head. Uh, it's pretty strong, though. So, obviously, it scales with strength. Uh, motivity. Fuck it. All right. So, we haven't checked in on... Use of a need craft machine at the hotel yet. Welcome we haven't to talked to this guy in a while. Okay, he's got nothing new. Let's talk to the old lady. She's still sitting there. People have no idea so many secrets are buried in crowd. Did she change Thanks outfits? I think she did. What are you curious about? Did you change? 
Oh, what's this? That book reminds me. Have you ever heard the fairy tale about a mischievous wooden puppet? All of Krat knows the story. All because of someone who loved that story more than anyone else. Oh, but this is strange. I, I do not recall... Who exactly was that someone? Me. That Pinocchio. book reminds me. Have you ever heard the fairy tale about a mischievous wooden puppet? All of Krat knows the story. All oh, yeah, but this is strange. I, I, who ex <laughs> That's funny. How many quarts do I have? That's what I want to know. I must have like at least two. And then we'll go check in on the lady, guys. The, the, the lady that mentioned the police officer. Where's the cat? That's more important, actually. Do you like me now? Okay. I'm heartbroken every single time. So weirdo? Remember, I didn't design every puppet in Krat. It is not surprising that some puppets broke away from the Grand Covenant. I've no idea how many. I remember a few ergo puppets behaving according to their own volition before the frenzy. That wasn't our intention. They were never designed to act that way. But if a puppet starts acting on its own, does that mean the puppet has free will? Or is someone else controlling the puppet? That's a great question, Geppetto. Is that, that's all you've come up with in the past three hours? Just sitting the there? City. Shame on you. You should be on the streets with me, fucking fighting these puppets, man. Coward. Worst enemy. I hope he's the final boss. <laughs> I have zero quartz. Fuck. Alright, whatever. Let's go to the police lady. It doesn't seem like there's anything, guys. Or else it would show up here, right? Like, whenever the baby situation, like, we, uh, it showed the little baby head. Maybe we go check just in case. Fuck it. Let's just go on a little adventure. An adventure with the homies. This episode is such a mess. I wouldn't be surprised if no one's watching right now. If you're watching right now, let me know down below. I would, I, I just... I want to give you, I want to give you my heart, just for being, just for being here, you know? Oh my god, it's daytime. Of course. Oh, that's so cool. It's like a whole new area. I almost forgot about you, pal. Damn it. Alright, so where was this place? I think we was just, yeah, we just gotta take the ladder. That ladder, I believe. Yeah, yeah, literally right there. If only we could play together like we used to. Matt. Murphy, I miss you. All right, before we actually close off the video, I want to quickly check what was outside of... Where was it? I believe here. Yeah, there was like an area there that we kind of... We didn't really check out fully, so let's see what that's all about. I honestly can't wait to get into a new area, though. I, I really enjoy my time in this factory, although we got lost quite a few times, but I want to see what was outside here. Hopefully it's not another one of those fucking giant enemies. I really hate them. They're probably my least favorite um, enemies in the game so far. For sure. You got these little girls here. It's kind of weird. All right. Yeah. Hello, good friend. Nothing to see here. Just get it known by. Oh. Oh, fuck. This keeps going. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. Oh, it was just a small area. With a little butterfly. Okay, I just want to get all the items. Cool. Ouch. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on. Damn, bro. This reminds me so much of that, that area in, uh, in Yarnum. Like, literally, like, the very- one of the very first, like, areas. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Okay, guys, I think my camera overheated again. <laughs> shit. All right, guys, I'm closing off the video here because my camera overheated once again. I think it's just because, like, lately doing work, I've been in a lot of meetings, so I have my camera on, like, all fucking day, which is really bad. Next episode, we'll be going into the new area, which I'm super excited about. And let me know how long that boss took you guys because, uh, yeah, I felt like I took quite the beating. Make sure to leave a like if you're still here. Secret word of the day. We haven't done those in a while. It's uh, Lil Fuoco. That's, that's the secret word, Lil Fuoco. Have a great weekend. I'll see you guys soon and peace.